Uh, Brent, fantastic job here, as I think uh, all of us who've been seeing all your work coming out in the last year uh, would feel. I I'm wondering here, considering how all of these memories are coming to you, all these, I guess you could kind of call them first time experiences for, for Jonas seeing, seeing all this stuff. Uh, how, what, what kind of first time experiences did you have making this movie in particular, or, or what kind of stories did you hear from uh, you know some of the, uh, the, the 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 veteran actors here that you know kind of informed you about even your you know your job, and how'd you get the baby to cry? Well, well, let's start with the latter question because that's a little more fun. I think um, as soon as the baby saw Philip's face, it just started crying. <laughs> So did I. <laughs> he was always with you when he cried, not with me. I was way over there. The honest truth, the honest truth is, at the start of the film, when I first met this kid, these two kids, uh, James and Alex, twins, they would put the babies in my arms and they would start crying instantly. And so it became, it became, you know, put the baby in my arms if you want to get it to cry and then get Brenton to put it somewhere and then he can kind of act crying. Um, but over the months, you develop a really strong bond with these kids, and it was, it was in a way, it was hard to see them go, you know, it was hard to let go. In, in terms of your first, though, like, first experiences here, how that may mirror your characters? Oh, first experiences yeah. on set? I guess every movie has its uniqueness, you know, that's the wonderful thing about being an actor, is you, can't, you kind of jump into a, a new, every job is kind of a, a different thing, and every movie is its own wild beast that you have to just kind of roll with, you know? Um, and I guess that's one of the things I learned from, you know, especially Jeff, who I did most of my scenes with, was you just kind of have to roll with it, you know, and do your best, do the best you can, um, and try and enjoy it along the way. That was one of the things that I really got from it. Jeff, you have been doing this for so long. I have to imagine, especially when young actors work with you, do, do they ask you for advice? And, and do you offer it? <laughs> uh, not that, uh, I, I offer, I mean, yeah. I offer. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think, man? Did I? You know. I, you know. I, uh, we just jam. You know. It's like. Um, you know. It's a musical expression, but it also works for making movies too. Uh, but um, Brenton plays guitar. We did a lot of jamming, actually. But uh, you know, having fun. My dad, uh, Lloyd Bridges. He, you know, taught me all the basics of acting. I remember when. I, when I got a part in Sea Hunt, he would, you know, set me on his bed and say, you know, now make it seem like it's happening for the first time, you know, but listen to me, don't just say your lines when my mouth stops, you know, you gotta, you know, let what I'm saying kind of inform how you say it, all those things. But the main thing I learned from my dad was um, really uh, just in observing how he worked and the joy that he had in doing what he loved doing. And that joy, uh, I worked. With, I got to work with him twice as an adult in Tucker and, and a movie called Blown Away. And in both those movies, whenever my dad came on the set, that joyful vibe kind of came with him, and that's it's contagious. It kind of runs through the you know through the whole company, and everybody goes, "Oh yeah, this is kind of fun. This is kind of you know advanced pretend, right? We got all the cool kids. We got the cool thing. It's fun, <laughs> and you kind of relax when you're feeling joyful, and then." All of the, you know, the good stuff gets to come through, you know, you know, so, you know. We, we actually, we had an amazing, I mean, we, we filmed in South Africa, and it was just, it was a really magical set, and, you know, Cameron, Brent, and they all play guitar, and, and Taylor came, and Taylor played guitar, and Odea would sing, and Michael would play, pia Michael was playing piano, so, and, you know, it was, it was, we were in a really interesting part of the world, um, doing this, doing something really special, so it was, it was a pretty... Amazing time.